Hello, hello everyone, and welcome back to this Prussian DOS mod playthrough. So, the siege of Sarajevo is about to begin. Well, the siege has ended, and the attack on Sarajevo is about to begin. So, I'll see you on the battlefield. And here we are. So, we'll set up our artillery here, maybe? Let's take a look at the range. Decent, apparently. Only covers about half the town, so I'll have to push it up uh, a bit more. Something like this. Well, I got the ridge in the way, right there. Uh, this is a bit, a bit better. I think I'll place them there. And yeah, now they cover uh, about the entirety of the deployment zone. So that's good. Let's see, every single one of my men. Place them here. And when the cannons have their first shot, oh, this is messed up. Had to fix that. There we go. And when the cannons uh, have a shot off their first shots, I'll let all the men advance, and hopefully they won't be damaged by my own artillery. That would be silly. So we'll end the deployment, start the battle, and let the guys fire, and then place the uh, move order. There we go. First shots are uh, going off. Come on. Fire. Well, they apparently, apparently won't fire at all, so... I can safely advance, I guess. So yeah, Rome 2 coming out in three days. I'm very excited. And of course I'm gonna be doing a lot of uh, walkthroughs. That's a plan anyway. And I'm gonna be doing uh, multiplayer battles. I've never been good at um, the melee based uh, battles in Total War, but I never really tried to get into them because I started my multiplayer career in Photo Samurai and I'm, I'm decent at it, but compared to the pros, um, well, I'm really nothing. I, I know that. <laughs> I've participated in some tournaments and, well, that hasn't ended too well. I think I haven't won a single battle in. Uh, uh, well, tournament-wise, but I will be try. I'll try to get into the, um, as I said, the old melee aspect of the multiplayer scene. That'll be fun. So, um, well, I must apologize for the lack of videos recently, and that's just because I have a lot of work. So, I have a lot of work to do. I have a job, a part-time job, but. Uh, it's uh, only well it's not a typical part-time job it's just shy of a full-time job so <laughs> I don't have too much free time unfortunately so that's why the videos have been a bit sporadic so I apologize for that I think it's been three or four days since the last one and that shouldn't happen but unfortunately that's the way it is And I was thinking something else. What was it again? Uh, yeah, and because of that, I don't really know. I don't know how frequent I can upload the uh, ROM 2 content. It will hopefully be regular and uh, immediately when the game launches. That's of course that is of course good for me and good for you both. But as a, once again, I don't know. I don't know how frequently I will be able to actually do that. Okay, this building isn't occupied, so I could charge the um, the cavalry if it hadn't been for um, for them retreating. I'll go for the artillery instead then. Let's see. I saw some guys not routing but wavering. I think it was these guys. Might have been. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Destroying the. Uh, the town or the suburb I don't really know I think it's a suburb let's see that might be Sarajevo yeah I don't see any other other towns around there ah oh, artillery it's now routing that's good so they are treating well, not retreating, but they are um, they are massing their forces at the back of the city, so that will make fighting a bit uh, a bit trickier, just because of the buildings and 
everything like that, making it making it a bit complicated. These guys are actually wow. These guys are actually losing. They are fighting Ulans with sabers, and I don't think I clicked an attack order on them. I think I clicked an attack order on the on the mortars, and they still lost. Wow. Anyway, now we can take out the artillery safely. Or comparatively safely. Haven't lost too many horses yet. Oh, forgot about you. And yeah, because of the whole work situation, I don't have too much time today. Um, so this will, I think this part will just consist of this battle and that's it. Uh, I'm sorry about that, but once again, I don't have too much time. It's really unfortunate. I want to, I want to, uh, churn out this content and I really love playing this campaign, but, well, what can I do? When life gets in the way of things. Hmm, nice column. Oh, these guys came back. Oh, fucking hell. Now these guys are glitched. Well, that'll be fun. Because of this one guy stuck in there. I should direct my artillery on them. Probably should. So, their cavalry has retreated. And I'll push up my line a bit. Like, uh... Come on, I saw a region which I could actually place them in. No, I don't really want to do that. So I'll I'll rather take you guys and push you up uh, like uh, this, I think. Hmm, these guys were already damaged. Okay, I don't need a square anymore. I'll just do this and something like this. Well, not maybe like that because that might that might get me in range of these guys, and I don't want don't want to wally from them if it uh, can be avoided. I believe we can take it, but as I said, unnecessary casualties. Oh. Venice doesn't even have fire by rank. That's a bit sad. Oh yeah. They are um, broken. Only broken. So they might return. But I don't think so. Not that the, um, the speed of this battle. But that's uh, anything to go by. Oh, the uh, the glitched uh, the glitched uh, cavalry man is um, no longer a problem. As you can see, there's no green dot inside his house. Um, there are almost green dots in those houses. I'll try to get my cavalry out of there. I'm sick of it uh, being bugged and everything. That will of course run in front of these guys, which I try to avoid. So let's do something like that. Try not to run them into my own guys too much. And have them take casualties that way. Push up a bit. These guys have returned, as I predicted. Hmm, conscripts. Well, they have helmets at least. Look. It looks like metal. It might just be filt. It should be filt um, or uh, any sort of cloth, uh, if they aim to be historically accurate. Hmm, cavalry. Well, that failed, didn't it? Okay, we can take out these guys, so they won't be bothering us too much anymore. For sure. 
over on this flank. The militia is not doing too good. And this guy is, uh, well, he's doing something. Running, he will soon be doing. And so are these guys. Now I have these guys left and these guys. Oh, I forgot about my artillery. They're just me firing, uh, firing at will, so God knows uh, who they have actually um, targeted. These guys are broken, so no use in actually targeting them. These guys will get, be getting charged by my cavalry pretty soon. I think I'll go for these guys. They are kind of protected by buildings, but they are as, as good as lost this battle anyway. I believe I have uh, a stronger melee component, so let's put that theory th to the test. Theory, yeah, theory, there we go. Try to be a bit proper at least. Ooh. There we go, go to charge off and everything. I think I have ba better bayonets than he has, at least on the tech tree. As I said previously, I don't know if that actually matters or anything. And now these guys are um, preparing for the cavalry, but they are not prepared, as Illidan would say. Yes, they are getting into square. That means I have to run up like this. Well, they try to get into a square. I have to correct myself a bit there. So this is basically just to hold them up for the time being. And I believe I can pull out. That's actually the end of the battlefield, so I can't click there. Oh, some guys have um, returned. And they're actually firing at my flank. That's not good. Line infantry. Okay. At least we don't have to fire to um, slaughter uh, conscripts. Yeah. I'll go for you guys. And... You might actually need some help over here. I think I'll just uh, silence the artillery for time being. And these guys are militia, so there should be no match for my men. These guys have uh, taken a beating and are rotting. And these guys they are still standing, but not anymore. There we go, Ulans. They have almost entered the building. Gotta love the pathfinding. All that is left is their artillery and this militia unit, which is bound to break. Actually, let's make sure. Let's make sure that they break. So, come on, Ulans. There we go. And they are, they are pretty much dead. And uh, wow, that's a path. The plan was kind of attacking them in the back. <laughs> I, I actually hope you guessed that, but I guess not. Here we go. This should, uh, this should uh, uh, secure a victory. Well, the victory is secured, but secure route, I should say. And there we go, everyone, every single one, routed. Heroic? Well, I wouldn't say so. I outnumbered them and everything. They did have something better than me, didn't they? Like, quality-wise? Okay, let's look at the kills. Ulans, 239, wow. 
Let's see, it's Hakers. 90 kills, not bad. That's the artillery, if you if you didn't know. And I can't actually do anything. Oh, there we go. I had to scroll with it. General's bodyguard? Did he actually get kills? What? Huh. Oh, yeah. I, I think I know, know what happened. Because uh, I technically didn't kill all of them. But because this is a siege, I, I kill all the defenders. So it might have been that um, the remainder of the men, th which I didn't actually kill on the battlefield, that uh, uh, those kills got um, spread out amongst the remaining units. Might have been what happened. I, I don't know really. I haven't really checked that before. So, Kiev is ours. Moscow is ours. Vienna is ours. Venice is ours. And of course Poland, so that's some major cities, some uh, former capitals of uh, other countries. And yeah, we're actually pretty close to uh, doing what uh, what we Germans uh, failed to do, like uh, 300, 300 and uh, 300 and let's see, 320 years later, no 200 and 20 years later and by we Germans I mean me playing as as uh, a Prussian I'm not <laughs> I'm not a German anyway Russia at war uh, St. Petersburg is the next target probably or Riga well once I get control of this and I I crack down on the the uh, raiding armies I'll uh, march on St. Petersburg. Hopefully, I'll have to stay here a bit and uh, uh, until this reaches uh, well, become positive. Actually, this uh, these guys need a bit of re repairing. I think that actually uh, that's it. We uh, what that's it of what we can do for this uh, turn. So we'll end it and see if anything signif significant happens. And speed it up. Hmm. France got a lot of stuff to do, apparently. Hmm, there we go. Why not? Love to see another trade partner, because more money. Mm -hmm. Russia not doing anything uh, significant. Not yet, anyway. Well, they are kind of coming for me. I don't know. They're at least walking in the direction of Moscow. Corland, as useless as ever. Oh yeah, rebellion. Kind of expected that. Workers' riots soon be uh, will soon be a another rebellion. So we can finally repair this. And how much do they want for me to repair my army? That's affordable. There we go. Austrian rebels. Let's see. I might have enough. I've got some reinforcements coming in. Or maybe not. Militia has at least something. They don't have... Well, they do have cavalry. Hmm. Might be a waste of good general here. Actually, I'll retreat. And I'll rather bring in some troops from... I'll actually won't bring in some troops. I'll just... Um, 
I'll just uh, recruit right here. And I, I think I'll be able to win if they actually go for Vienna right away. That shouldn't be a problem. Of course, I can bring in some troops from here. But now it's too late. They won't. Uh, I don't think they will. I don't think they will actually um, reinforce. Anyway, let's go. Okay, they are in range of those guys. Nope. Still not a good idea. Let's see. Of course, now we need more men down here. There we go. And we need to repair our army in Moscow. And recruit another unit. There we go. That's about it We uh, what we can actually do, e economically-wise. Might do something out of this turn, but that will be a another video. I don't have time for anything else, as I previously stated several times. But hopefully you enjoyed this, and as always, I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.